Hello there, today I show you my Neon Light 3D Sketch Photoshop action. How to use it and custom it and give you some extra tri uh, tri tricks. Uh, this is the previously applied some result. There is the some result, you can check it. This is the original photo and this is the result. And there is another original photo and uh, original photo and uh, the masking point. Then uh, apply the our script, this is the result. See the another looking and the sample photo and the looking. This is the example and our effect look looking and another color combine see it and uh, original photo direction and this is the looking see. Check out you can very easily change the color option of neon or you can uh, combination yourself. See the looking is uh, great. I think is uh, great. Okay now uh, i show you first how to use then i give you some tricks and tips first go my download file there is show help file you can read the help file there is some size and some information our help line uh, instruction there and the written instruction how to use include there okay this is the script and this is the pattern pattern need to uh, supporting option need to load first then our load script select uh, pattern and double click the mouse then it's loaded your photoshop automatically or you can load manually uh, go the your photoshop go window and the pattern option you just uh, check out the pattern option now pattern option option on, on then go input pattern and find out my download file their uh, folder and select the pattern load me first and load button click now it's loaded the last one is the our loading pattern okay now go window and action option click then action option show ma maybe show the right side in your place i have settled it left side for my better understanding purpose and go window and the layer panel option click now layer panel is show see okay and uh, you can load it very easily our photoshop action go there option and the load button click now you can find out my download file and neon light script photoshop action load uh, select and load button click now it's loaded now i have opened a photo first time i have opened this photo please make sure your photo is a rgb color mode and must be lock background layer mode if not then uh, action make the error result so is sometimes some photo look like png transparent or layer zero format that is not accept the action you need to fix it right button click your mouse and fit an option click now is set a fit an option lock, lock background layer and go this option panel option this one and entire document and uh, all all are tick mark as it is my setting this is not only uh, required for my action all over the action uh, this is the basic rule and now make sure your photo is RGB color mode. If not, then go image mode and RGB just click there. Okay. And check out my image size. If do not need the extra image, uh, uh, the target is fixed your image size, then you can type there. Otherwise, do not use the high resolution image, then it's more time extra needed. But you can um, use the any size of image. Any high resolution image work nicely. I have uh, used the 300 pixel is good and now I have used the quick selection tool for selection and masking purpose quick selection tool select then just click there and the quick selection tool select then there is show select subject button just click the select subject button option now your photo and focus is uh, first selection mode then create a new layer make sure create a new layer in top option and double click the new layer text option type there b r u s s brush same my spelling b r u s s do not include a space hyphen comma or mix up character only lowercase and click the blank space now we can fill it uh, you can use just uh, use uh, paint bucket tool just select the paint bucket tool and any of light color and just fill up the brush layer see if you brush the brush fill up the brush layer or you can if you want to the portrait style then uh, you can brush and uh, 
select uh, i just undo then show you uh, only portrait not full area so select the brush layer make sure and brush the area which you really need to focus now i think my brushing is finished i have a portrait style needed okay my portrait style is on and now selection mode is on if the selection mode is on you need to deselect first uh, deselect first otherwise uh, you play the script then action make the error result so deselect first or if you use the pen tool you must be delete the path then you can play the script okay but uh, my showing my process is perfect or easy this is the folder and this is the script i just select play me all in on play action play me hit the play button and it's uh, start working make sure you select the brush layer and hit the play button okay and uh, it's working depend on your pc configuration and image resolution size uh, sometime we have uh, uh, need the fixed photo size so you can use your photo uh, fixed photo size you can check out my help file there is some size i have mentioned you can use any of size that is totally your choice but classic or standard uh, pixel or mention my help file and i have used this photo 3000 pixel by any of site any of site or you can use 2500 pixel any of site now uh, hello there action is done working now we can custom there is more layer on view so there is more layer on view and more combination is uh, upcoming okay this is the stop finishing the result a message see the world looking my photo uh, effect looking is very very nice and fully professional on our hidden formula and i just show you now the tricks some of tricks tricks and uh, just uh, check it out and introducing our layer this is the background layer and you can uncheck all see the now your photo is the transparent mode but there is the black shade you can check out it the round black shade see there is black round shade so if you want to png transparent you must be uncheck the black shade background try it and the background color eye off and the background eye off now your photo is a png transparent and you can save it the export and the export png uh, export pro quick export as a png very easily just save it okay png transparent now uh, but i do not need this time i just show you the option and the black shade i have needed this is if you do not like the black shade you can uncheck this one or there is the lighting shading the photo this is a very important thinking if your photo is a good lighting and shading then uh, this option is work perfectly so if not your photo some of time of some photo not perfectly photo shoot so uh, firstly uh, i recommend adjust it or you can adjust there this option double click this option light shading adjust and uh, try it this option and uh, double click this uh, adjustment and the uh, brightness you can make it the brightness there see check it uh, check it and contrast option so you can control full adjustment use this tool see the shading is there is show and changing option and more brightness but i do not need the more brightness i want to like default setting as my setting if your photo is mistake some of area so then you can use this option okay and there is the all stock layer and everything is a, a separate layer setup see check it the darkness or fatness and uh, this is the default setting so if not needed you do not change this and uh, this is the uh, neon option you just uncheck the news of uh, neon option then there is the show sketch looking see the sketch looking so there is the dual effect looking or you can combination many more and view this one neon effect and double click the color changing option 7 you can very easily change the color 
just click the option the change the option see the looking color is very shining and glossy or dynamic color looking and uh, you can set up any of color you can uh, arrange the color uh, mode there but default color setting mode is perfect just change the top color hue option okay see it you can uh, set up any of them now there is the adjustment you can check out the default adjustment if you like you can uh, set up it and there is more option check it okay you can uh, combine and combine see the dynamic looking this is the color grading option and the dual combine okay now i show you the another photo it is uh, perfect for better shading and lighting photo this is full professional photography see it and uh, now i have made the space some um, you can use any of a space that is your choice and the uh, image size i have typed there to 500 pixel any of site you can use any of size and quick selection to select subject button and uh, my selection is on then create a new layer and type there brush and uh, brush to select and brush the area so i think i brush this area and uh, this area okay now it's perfect i think it's perfect now and uh, selection deselect now select and hit the play button start working just scroll down depend your image size and pc configuration uh, we have work in a scarce resource 20 plus new resource upcoming only for sketch section and they all are different concept and different theory apply and different hidden resource our so you can check out our profile all are available day by day see the looking is there it is so nice and uh, there is the perfectly replaced our shading you can select the max point this option and select the brush and you can uh, use the sub brush there and you can uh, list the effect if some area you do not like to neon effect so you can just brush see others area you can just normal way brush now it's removed only your target area show so you can brushing yourself or you have use your brain I just show you the option and there is the option okay and changing the color automatically change everything 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 thanks for see this video and purchase this product still if you need any kind of help you can send a message our profile MRI studio you can live chat with us our Facebook fan page MRI studio and you can send a message live our WhatsApp number also you can mail us and you can directly purchase our product our on-site photoshop.net photoshopaction.net